A school bus carrying 43 students on the way to Aptos High and Junior High Schools went up in flames Tuesday morning. Mama can't see the school bus. CHP says a Kia sedan drifted into oncoming traffic, crashing head on and ending up underneath the bus. A fire sparked from the Kia's engine and quickly spread while the bus driver rushed the students to safety. All of a sudden there were flames coming from the car and then the bus was, then I realized that both the, both the bus and the car were on fire. And I was really nervous that maybe it would explode. The inside of the bus was gutted and charred. Because it was really bad. I honestly thought the driver was deceased. This video shows a firefighter cutting the vehicles apart. CHP says the driver of the Kia and a 13-year-old student were taken to the hospital, but sustained only minor injuries. No one was seriously hurt. It's shocking, yeah. Uh, I, I would have thought there would have been more injuries come out of that. The scene that morning rattling residents who recall other crashes outside their homes into fences and power poles. They say it's all too common on this stretch of road. There's a power pole there. This one is cement that it's been hit so many times that they encased it in cement thinking that that would help and it didn't. So this fence has been hit several times. So the last time it got hit, the people who live here said, will you please leave that pole there as a barrier? Back out here live, CHP says that at this point they don't know how fast either vehicle was traveling at the time of the crash. And they don't know why that driver of that Kia sedan drifted into the other lane. However, they say at this point they are ruling out drugs or alcohol being a factor in this fiery crash. Live in Watsonville, I'm Christian Balderas, KCW, Action News 8. All right, very good. Christian, thank you.